Hey, everybody. <laughs> Rachel Love with the Rachel Love Show. Five minutes with Cat Cannabis. You know Cat Cannabis from the Cat and Sheila Show and the Cat Cannabis Show and the Wicked Housewives. And she has her own uh, TV show there on Cape Cod, the Wicked Housewives in Cape Cod. So I'm really pleased to have her here. And we have her here tonight for a special. I say a special reading because we've had somebody on YouTube say, hey, I never did find out what you said about Trump's wives. Because last season on Wicked Housewives, they were doing the cards for the presidential candidates and talking about uh, what the cards predicted. But never got around to, or we did, we lost. I'm not exactly sure what happened, but we, we lost the Trump wives cards. And so there's interest in it. So I know if you're interested, everybody's interested. So Cat Cannabis, welcome to the show. Oh, thank you so much, Rachel. And yes, we, we actually did a five-part show, and so it was kind of stretched out, and that was Sheila and I. And uh, so I didn't put all the wives in one show. I had them stretched out, but yeah, I can do that now. Yeah, you got some cards handy? Yeah, I do. Okay, so let's talk about Ivana Trump. Okay. Ivana Trump was born February 20th. I'm not going to give the year, and I'm not going to give her age because it's really not important. We're all young at heart. So anyhow, she is the five of diamonds. And here's the five of diamonds card, Rachel. And it's really an interesting card. So if you're in a, with a playing deck, it looks like this. And that is the five of pentacles in the tarot cards. And if you remember, the pentacles deal with health, wealth, and relationships on the earth plane. And this is probably one of the least desirable cards in the whole deck. You know, I love all the cards, except this one. <laughs> so if um, Ivana Trump were truly just a regular five of pentacles, she would actually be the destitute, lonely, unemployed person on the outside looking in, trying to take care of her inner self, her little inner child. It, it's really... A really sad card but the good part the good side to this card is in case you are a five of pentacles is in this lifetime you're figuring out how to be independent take care of yourself and make your way into the church within your heart whatever that is so this does not fit Ivana, right? It does. It. She, she's she's a multi gazillionaire, right? It does seem so, a little upside down, doesn't it? Yes, it does. And that is because she is one of the few reverse tarot cards I've met. She is a reverse five of pentacles. And, and those are hard to find. But the, and you know if someone is a reverse when everything they say about them, they're destitute, they're lonely, they're unemployed, they're out in the cold, they're barefoot and walking through the snow, doesn't fit. They're a reverse. So if you read tarot cards um, and you actually are reading for someone and they go, no, no, that absolutely is not me. They may be a reverse. So now let's move into the second wife. Marla Maples, October the 27th. She is the eight of hearts. Mm -hmm. And if you remember, the eight of hearts is the eight of cups. It's right here. And the eight of cups, just so you can, you can really see it right there, take, take a good look. Now the journey. There we go. I see it better now. No, put it back to the to the right there. There, right there. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. The Eight of Cups is all about the journey. Mm -hmm. It's not about getting from point A to point B. It's the journey in between. And so you see, he's the the in this in this card. He's turned his back on now, and he's going into the mountains to find himself. The journey is all about self. And what I love about this card is this person is being watched by the male and female side of themselves because they have the moon and the sun in their card. Yes, okay. And that's Marla Maples. And then finally, this is the most interesting. It is Melania Trump. And we all saw her probably on the debates. I mean, I'm, in, I'm an independent. 
but yeah. I watched everything. I, I, I can't get enough of everything. And then I, I sit back and I go, oh, my gosh, the circus has come to town. Has. But, and that speech was said before, too, so it got a lot of press on that speech. It did. It did. <laughs> and she was gorgeous. Oh, my gosh. She's beautiful. Um, you know, but she is the eight of clubs. And if you remember from my other shows, the clubs are – the wands that is an eight of wands and wands if you're a wand it's all about coming up with with all these fabulous ideas in the sixth and seventh and eighth dimension and you pull them down into the third dimension you put them together like pieces of a puzzle but this is the only card rachel where the wands are not in the ground they're sprouting in the air because they're all headed for their target. They never touch the ground. They have a specific thing they want to accomplish in this lifetime, and they're not landing until they hit it, and that is Melania. Now, what's really interesting about these cards also, Rachel, yeah. is of all the cards, the one card that is not compatible with Donald is Melania. We oh, right now. Yeah. This is the one card he should not <laughs> be with. And the one card he should be with. Oh, wait, this is getting juicier all the time. Oh, my. Is the one he passed up. So you think we're going to see something in the future? The flavor of the moment. Are we going to see something, a shakeup in the future? Is that what you're saying the cards are saying? We might. We might. Because. Um, Maybe and maybe not, and here's why. This card is the card of a person who has a, an agenda, yeah. and they're not giving up until they've achieved it. And so because she is so much younger than the Donald, she may be around a lot longer. So yeah. this card yeah. says to be continued. <laughs> I love it. Well, thank you so much for coming on my show. You're so and welcome. I thought it was so much fun. Catch up the Cat Cannabis show on, of course, on New Earth International. Find her on Facebook, Cat Cannabis. Um, Google her. You'll find her. And she's a remarkable woman uh, doing some amazing things. I wrote a couple of books and uh, writing some more books. And this really is uh, kicking butt on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> but we got to go. This is a short road. Uh, the guy who wanted to know what the cards would say, I'm so glad you asked, right? I'm so freaking glad you asked. This is going to be a fun time. I'm not saying fun time because Mr. Trump, the Donald, is president. I'm not saying that. Now remember, I'm a Democrat. But I'm saying <laughs> to watch what this journey is going to be about, it's going to be a lot of fun. Can't miss it. Bye-bye, everybody. Good night. <laughs>